How's it going? Today I'm going to teach you how to hold a plectrum. The first thing we want to do when holding a pick is we want to find the tip of it, the pointed part. If we just grab that with the thumb and index finger of the opposite hand, and now we're going to place the thumb over the top of the pick. Now the first thing we're looking for is to make sure that we're not exposing too much of the pick. If we expose too much like that, as soon as we come to start strumming the guitar, there's a good chance that the pick's going to go flying out of our hands. So we only want roughly about that much. Okay, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to bring the index finger underneath. Now I personally like to put it on the side of my index finger, but you could also put it on the flat. Experiment with both of those and see what feels comfortable to you. They're both right, it's just whatever feels comfortable to you. Now the next thing, we want to look at the thumb. We want to make sure we try and keep this straight like that. We don't want any extremes like doing it like that, bent that way, and we don't want to bend it too much that way. If you bend it a little bit of the knuckle this way, that's okay because we're going to do that kind of thing for speed picking later on. But generally we don't want anything like that or that. Just generally straight. Next thing we want to look at are the fingers. We want to make sure these are nice and relaxed. We don't want to bring them in where we could make a fist and then we're going to tense our arm up which is going to slow us down in the future when we want to do speed picking kind of things. We want to do our best to just keep these nice and relaxed and spread out. The next thing you want to do now is you want to bring this part of the arm and rest it over this part of the guitar. And then with the bottom part of the hand, we want to hover that above the bridge, this part of your guitar. Okay, the reason why we want to do that is we want to get our hand into a good position from the beginning. If we get used to playing over here, we're only going to have to bring it back over here in the future when we do various techniques, when we're going to be going on and off of the strings. So it's a good idea from the beginning to keep the hand there. Next thing we want to do is make sure that our arm is straight when we start picking. So the arm is just straight along there. We're not bending out. A lot of people do this from the beginning for some reason. I probably did it as well. But do your best not to do that where you're bringing the arm out. We're just keeping the whole arm straight like that. Next thing now, let's just pick the low open string, the thicker string on the bottom. Now what we're doing is we're picking from the wrist. We're not using the arm to pick, we're just using the wrist. Notice that the movement. Okay, just practice that slowly, get used to that movement. Just playing the low string, just playing from the wrist. And the last thing to look at is when we're playing from the wrist, we're bringing it down, and notice that I'm not going too far into the strings. I'm not doing anything like that, where I've got to come all the way up. I'm just going down, just brushing across the string. And I'm keeping the pick in line with the string also. I'm not doing anything like that. Not bring it down that way. Just keeping it in line with the string. And picking down. 